God is moving powerfully. Jeremiah chapter 31, encouraging us in verse 4. I will build you up again, and you, virgin Israel, will be rebuilt. Again, you will take up your timbrels and go out to dance with the joyful. Now, I know that many of us are facing tremendously difficult circumstances. But the promise of the Lord is, this is not the end of the story. We will once again be able to go out into the streets, <laughs> move around freely. We will be able to dance. We will be able to rejoice with people. And the Lord is going to do something in our hearts and in our circumstances that causes us to live in the fullness of his joy and to be able to share that joy with so many others. The Lord's promise is to build us up. He's building us up for the purpose of joy. Hallelujah. Let's look forward to good things ahead. Let's pray. Lord, we are so encouraged by your word that would speak to us in the middle of our circumstances and give us the promise of joy that lies ahead. Thank you that we will be able to gather again with the joyful and that we will be able to enjoy the fruit and the benefit of what you do and what you accomplish in building us up again. And so we choose to embrace this word even though there's so many things that want to manifest in the opposite. We choose to believe your word to us. Thank you that you are the God of joy. One of the fruit of the Spirit is joy. And you're causing us to live in your joy. Hallelujah. Amen. May you have a joy-filled day. <laughs>